Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing this super springy, glowy look. It's basically my go-to spring and summer look, especially if I'm going to be out in the sun because I have SPF on and it's just kind of like my go-to. So if you want to see that, keep watching and if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Also, everything that I mentioned in today's video will be listed down below in the bottom bar in case you're looking for it. All right, let's get into it. If the coloring on my skin looks a little bit off, it's because I'm trying out two different tanning products, one for my body and then one for my face. And so in person, my face looks like it's a little bit splotchy right now. It is developing, so I guess we will see. Anyway, we're gonna go in right now. I'm using the Origins Ginseng Gel Moisturizer. I'm almost out of this, which I'm so sad about, but I'm just going to moisturize my skin with this. And then I'm also going to go in with the Ginseng, um, what is this, the Refreshing Eye Cream. This will really brighten up your under eyes, and so if you're ever tired or like need to be de-puffed, this stuff works wonders. But when I do glowy looks, I just like to add a little bit of this under my eyes. And it does kind of have like a pearly color. I always go in with my ring finger because it is your most delicate finger. You don't want to tug or anything at your eye area. So I'm just kind of patting this in. And then I'm going to let this dry for about two or three minutes just to let it kind of sink into my skin. And then we will move on. Moving on, I'm going to prime my skin with the Becca Backlight Priming Filter. This stuff is awesome. Um, I'm just going to pump it onto my fingers and then just kind of place it onto my skin. And as you can see, this is going to make your skin look really glowy and dewy, which is great to sit under any kind of coverage that you're going to use, which today, I actually just did a full video on this, but it's the um, It Cosmetics Buy My Foundation Full Coverage Moisturizer. So this is what I'm going to use as coverage for my skin today. I'll link the video that I did on this up here and then down below in the bottom bar, but it just has a pump and I'm going to pump out and then just put it directly onto my skin. I know some people don't like to wear coverage in the summer, but I have just acne prone skin and I have a lot of scars, so I do like to still have coverage in the summer. And this stuff has SPF 50, so it's really good to use even if you are gonna be out in the sun. So I, I'm just kind of a coverage kind of girl. I wish I could get away with not wearing coverage, but that is just not where I'm at right now. I can tell right now that blending this in that my forehead is definitely getting more tan because this shade matched me really well yesterday and it's definitely looking a little light right now. In the warmer months, I try to use fewer powders and so I'm gonna go in with this Burberry uh, face contour stick and this is in the shade medium. And I'm just gonna use this to contour. And then I'm gonna use my Eco Tool sponge again just to blend that contour out. I'm not going to set my entire face with powder. I'm just going to go over certain areas in powder. Like I'm going to go in with my Eco Tools full powder brush and my NARS Laguna bronzer. And I'm just going to kind of set down the areas with bronzer instead of doing an all over powder. So only areas with like bronzer or blush will um, end up having powder on them. While I have my bronzer out, I'm just gonna go in with a large fluffy brush, take some of that and then just set my eyelids because I did take that foundation onto my eyelids. So I just wanna make sure that I don't have a million creases on there, but I'm not gonna actually do anything major on my eyelids today. I just want to set them down and give them a little bit of definition. And then I'm gonna go in with my Hourglass Vanish Flash Highlight. This is in the shade Champagne. And I'm just gonna take this with my finger and just kind of dot this on the high points of my cheekbones. And I'm just gonna really get a nice glow going. As you can see, my skin is already pretty glowy just from the other prep that we've done. And then I'm going to take this down the center of my nose 
and onto my cupid's bow and then i'm also just going to take a little bit and put it onto my eyelid and just a little bit on my brow bone i would usually do blush after i do highlight but today i'm actually going in I went in with my highlight first and now I'm going to go in with my blush. This is the Milani Baked Blush in Luminoso. This is one of my favorite blushes to wear in the summer because it does have a little bit of a sheen. And so it's just a really nice peachy color and it will just continue the glow. And now that I'm done with my face makeup, I'm going to set it with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. I'm just going to set it and then I'm going to blend it back out with my Eco Tool sponge like I always do. For my eyes, I'm keeping it super simple. I'm just going to do a really thin black line with my Maybelline Curvitude Liner. And I'm just going to follow my eye line just to make my lash line look a little bit thicker. But I'm not going to do a wing or anything like that. I'm literally just gonna try and make my lash line look a little bit thicker, but it's gonna be super natural. So that is all I'm doing. Do it on the other side. I'm gonna pop on my Stila Huge Extreme Lash Mascara and then I'll be right back. Okay, I just finished my mascara and now the last thing I'm gonna do is wipe off my lip balm so that I can put on another lip balm. I'm just gonna go in with my Sugar Fresh Lip Treatment. I just mentioned this in my February favorites. It's in the shade Rosé. It is my favorite, but I'm just gonna, I like how it just adds like a little, little wash of color. Nothing too crazy, but this is everything for my, this is kind of like my everyday spring and summer makeup look. I have SPF on. This actually has SPF as well. The, sun, the sunscreen is SPF 15 in my lip balm. My lips always get really burned. I have no idea why because my skin doesn't really burn that much, but I have SPF all over my face and on my lips, so I'm totally protected from the sun, and this is just a nice, really glowy look for spring and summer. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.